it's winter, so I have my coat, of course. Um, for anybody who is not a medical professional, this is not the white coat that I mean. I have a professional white coat. Anyway, on to my introduction. Um, I'm just off work, hence the messy hair and the lack of makeup that's worn off at this point. But I felt motivated to come and share my day and my latest when the white coat comes off story with today's selection of wine because it's wine down Wednesday. At least it is while I'm recording this video. I'll try not to spill anything. Okay, so I will start with my day today. So I have been trying to become like that girl, be bougie now that I'm making like physical therapist money and be cute, right? So I wear press on nails now. They are bougie on a budget where I can do my nails at home, but like have a little cute cuteness, a little pizzazz. The problem is they last for a few weeks and then with all of my hand washing and everything, they start to come off. Um, like you know, one or two nails here or there. I just reapply them, but that's to preface tonight's story. I'm at work, last patient of the day. I have been throughout the day without losing a nail and without having this issue because it's been like going on two weeks that I did them now. And I'm like, it's about time to redo them, but we're gonna make it stretch, okay, girl? So I'm walking with a patient. I just came from washing my hands and stuff in the bathroom. So my hands are obviously still a little damp, at least from like around my nail bed and everything. And I'm walking with them with a gate belt and I am trying to hold the gate belt and putting my hand in, my nail pops off. Hello all, welcome to another episode of When the White Coat Comes Off. And I thought it would be most fitting with me just getting off work and taking off. And I'm not seeing the nail on the floor. Then my mind starts to go like, okay, let me expand my radius for looking around. And I'm not seeing the nail anywhere around. Now I'm like, okay, obviously I feel like I have to blame the patient at this point. Um, sir, can you check your pants? Like, if your nail comes out of your pants tonight, I don't want to have to explain that to your wife. Just shake them out a little bit. So at this point, I have asked my patient to check his pants to see if my press on nail has gotten in the mix. I promptly am like, okay, it's on the floor somewhere. It's cool. It's cool. I have super glue in my bag. I'll make it work. It's fine. It happens. Not my finest moment. Long story short, um, my tech is like to the point where she's like, girl, I'll help you. It's fine. Like the laundry basket's nearby. I just put it in the laundry. Like, let me shake out everything. See if it got caught there. It's not there either. And then I start to think, I'm just like, let me, let me check my clothes. Girl, it was, it was in my pants. It was like looped into, cause, cause I'm wearing high waisted pants. So it was looped into my pants. I told my patient, it was like, it's okay. You won't have to explain anything later to your wife. I got it. And as you can see, I have them all on. It's all good. But that's been tonight's When the White Coat Comes Off. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, this is going to be my new filming area. Bear with me as I kind of work on my channel with branding, with uh, lighting, editing, stuff like that. We're trying to make a business here in 2022. So like, comment, subscribe. So like, comment, subscribe, and support your girl. I need to stop saying so, so much in my videos. But thanks for watching. Bye. Have a good night or day, you know, whatever you're going to have going on.